Welcome to our, our short demo on the great new macOS Hub CLI. So let's just get right into this real quick. So you go to you go to user local bin. You'll see in here you're gonna see that hub CLI. So it requires sudo. So we'll do that for testing. So let's just see what we see first. So you can see here it lists all your different commands, right? So we're just gonna we'll step through them for a minute. So if we go hub CLI config, so you can see here, it shows you all the different stuff you have, right? So we'll just do a nice little get. So we'll run this as sudo, of course. So you see here it shows you all your little settings, which is pretty neat. So that so that's one of so that's one of your features you have within there, right? And so then if we look at the rest of these things that we have out there, we'll look at it again, look at that list. The other one we're gonna we'll focus on is the sync. So you go hub CLI sync. See sync started, that's just forcing a device sync. Pretty straightforward. And the last one we're gonna look at, which I think is really neat is your uh, notify service. So if we look at this when we print the help, it shows you how it works, right? So we're gonna create one on the fly here. So we're gonna go hub CLI notify, and let's make something up here. So title, mobile John's demo, subtitle, this is my demo on notifications. And then we're going to add in the action button. And then we'll add in the script that says open. Safari. And we'll take it to our great website, mobilejohn.com. Okay, let's actually do it correctly, though. So you'll see here is that you have to actually add this in correctly. So you go A, launch. So you actually have to give it a name. So we're going to go Mobile John's blog. Hey, look at this. this is now you get this little notification. You hit Mobile John's blog, and it takes us right in there. Which is pretty cool. Like I said, this is nice and simple and easy. And just gives you a little bit of a preview into this great API that's now available.